should get a flat tire. Volkswagen roadside assistance should be your first choice for changing a tire. However, every driver should know how to change a tire properly in the event of an emergency or if roadside assistance might not be available. Review your owner's manual to learn the location of your jack and tool set and how to use them on your vehicle and for important safety information. To begin, the vehicle should be on level, firm ground. Automatic transmissions should be in park. Manual transmissions should be placed in reverse. For all vehicles, apply the parking brake and make sure the front wheels are aimed directly forward. Block the tire diagonally opposite of the tire being changed by using a wheel chalk, wooden block, brick, or some other object to help prevent vehicle movement when being raised by the jack. To change the tire, begin by removing the spare tire and toolkit from the trunk. Remove the covers from the lug bolts with the wire pin in the toolkit. If you have hubcaps as opposed to alloy wheels, you will use this for removing the hubcap as well. Now loosen the lug bolts with the wrench before raising the vehicle with the jack. Do not loosen the bolts while the vehicle is raised, as the motion may knock the vehicle off the jack. The bolts are loosened counterclockwise. If you have a locking wheel bolt, be sure to use the bolt adapter key in your toolkit. Place the jack at one of the lift points marked on the rocker panel. Use the lift point closest to the wheel being changed. Crank the jack until it makes firm contact with the rib under the rocker panel and make sure the base of the jack is securely flat on the ground. Continue cranking the jack until the wheel clears the ground. Make sure you have enough clearance for the fully inflated spare tire, but do not raise the vehicle higher than necessary. Remove all of the loosened lug bolts and set them aside. Remove the flat tire and place it in the trunk. Lift the spare tire onto the wheel hub bolts. Replace the lug bolts. Spin them down, but do not tighten them yet. Snug them slightly. Lower the vehicle to the ground and remove the jack. Be sure to crank the jack all the way back down so that it fits in the foam insert. Now be sure to tighten the lug bolts, but do not tighten them sequentially. Tighten any bolt first, then move to the bolt diagonal to it. Move around the bolts in a star pattern until all bolts are completely secured. Then repeat the pattern one more time, ensuring they are fully tightened. If you have a torque wrench, tighten them to the specification found in your owner's manual. If not, be certain to have the torque checked by your Volkswagen service department as soon as possible. Remove the wheel chalk or block and replace the toolkit and the trunk securely. If your spare tire is a compact spare, do not exceed the speed limit noted on the tire. This is a temporary spare only and the original tire should be replaced as soon as possible. We hope you never experience a flat tire. If you do change your own tire, be certain to review your owner's manual for important information and warnings.